I think Adolf, uh, that night when he, uh, we had, we entertained, uh, uh, that particular discussion in San Diego, I think his approach was, uh, if I had it to do all over again, I would, I would wish that I had the opportunity, uh, or I had the opportunity to be a trailblazer and I, uh, I chickened out. And it wasn't my it wasn't my character to chicken out, uh, and uh, I should have I should have gone ahead and just uh, uh, forced it to happen because I could have been a better person. Uh, as a result of that, I, I could have been a leader, uh, and I was in a position to do it. And I I uh, and in order to do it, I would have had to take it, take on the Southeastern Conference because uh, uh, African Americans weren't uh, allowed to even go to school in those days down in Mississippi uh, in Alabama. You know, it was just a different, totally different world. He, but he he was in a position to be a, a major trailblazer, uh, and I think that uh, Red Auerbach was in uh, with the Celtics in Boston. Uh, in integrating the, the NBA in the early days. And I think he, I think at the bottom line to all of that rest was that he felt he was just, uh, 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 we got to a point where he felt comfortable talking to me uh, because at the end of that night, he said something to me after he said, can't have, or I left him off at the hotel. He said, uh, if you ever tell anybody uh, while I'm alive what I just told you, I'm going to tell him, I'm going to, and they asked me about it, I'm going to tell him, are you lied? <laughs> so, 